What's up everyone? I'm Fearless Falcon and welcome back to Dark Souls Remastered. We are back trying to fight the Bell Gargoyles. I'm gonna go shut the door so I don't bother anyone because I am always just a constant noise machine and no one likes that. The current death count is 138. In case any of you are curious, that's our death count. And hopefully, that won't go up too much. I know it's gonna go up. I know for a fact it's gonna go up. Like, I'm already saying like, okay, cool. We're taking this first round of the mulligan. Like, there, there is no way in hell I'm gonna take the Bell Gargoyles out on my first try. That being said... If I could maybe take them out on like try number three or something? Mm -hmm. That'd be nice. I have a general clue what I'm doing. I have five Estus Flasks. I see you up there. Hang on. Try to load my Twitch so I can actually see if the stream crashes. I see you. You fight me? I fight you? No. No drinking. I am the only one around here that's allowed to heal. Especially not the bosses. <laughs> Could you imagine if the bosses could freaking heal? We'd never get anything done. Stab. Oh, I died! Great job, me! Dying before you even do anything. That's fine, though. Like I said, as I add that to the death count, the first round is usually a mulligan. I can't be expected to jump back into the game and be perfect after a week of not playing. Because that's the thing, I don't play this in my off time. Uh, like, there are a lot of games that I play where it's like, oh, I, I go, I play this in my off time because I like it. Dark Souls? No. I, I, I have, I have not, I do not touch this game off stream because I know that People would rather see me struggle. Would rather see the the endless struggle as I desperately try to handle things. So, like, you know, first round has to be, oops, didn't do everything perfectly. Cause you know, let my skills atrophy for a week. That being said. A second F up is not appreciated. To that end, stab time. Or maybe slice. Slice first, stab later. And get this body. Whatever's in here. Mine now. I don't need a broken straight sword. Why do I need broken swords? Can I fix those? Never mind. I don't need to know. But more important is finishing the area and tackling the bell gargoyles, which are still giving me trouble. We fought them for what an hour last time. Oh, right, you just jump right into it. Hang on. Whoa, okay. Dad, he's 
Stabby! That's fine, I knock you down to half health. The more I knock you down, the better. I got one! Holy shit, I got one of them! That was, that was, that was okay! Hang on, let me drink my water! Hey, other gargoyle! This is our best run! Never mind, it's not our best run. Nope, 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 I need to drink my water! Come on over here! Come on over here, let me kill you! You've got half health compared to me. I'm... I'm... I've still got two Estus Flasks. I'm gonna be fine. Can you please stop with the fire breath? I get it. You had, like, Chipotle for dinner or something. Friggin' not sponsored by Chipotle. Hit me with your sword! Hit me with your... Ow! Okay, well, I guess I didn't ask you to hit me with your sword. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. Did I get the tip? What are you talking about? The dragon's tail back on the bridge? No. Oh jeez! No 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 no! Hang on, I need to focus. I can't die now. One of them's dead. I can't lose. Will you stop freaking breathing fire at me, you overgrown asshole? Fine, throwing knives. Knife. No! 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 Son of a... This man and his stupid garlic breath. I would have gotten an axe. Oh, wait, hang on. I picked up a gargoyle axe during that fight. What was that? Friggin... This thing? The gargoyle's halberd? Insufficient strength to wield this weapon in one hand. Hold with both weapons to eat. Hold with both hands to use effectively. Uh, I guess I'll just unequip that until I have more strength to one-hand it. Good news, though, I took out one of the gargoyles! <laughs> That's progress. I'm doing better. I'm not perfect yet, but I'm doing better. That's all I can really ask for in this game. That I constantly improve so you don't get stuck doing the same fight over and over again. Because as much as I'm sure you guys love watching me struggle... problem. Never apologize for leaving. We all have lives, and I'm uh, never, that guy doesn't have a life. He's dead.
like as much as I would as much as I would love to be able to have uh As much as I would love to have, like, people that would just can watch every, can tune into every stream I do, uh, there is, there is never any incentive or, well, I guess there's the incentive of comedy, but there's never any, like, requirements or I'm never forcing anyone to sit around and watch. You know, we all have lives. I, I, I can't expect you all to, to take time out of your day every day to watch me. Unless I ultimately hire people to, to to be like moderators for the channel, in which case I expect you to be here constantly. Yeah, I don't really have much of a life either. This is this is what I this is what I like look forward to every day. Getting to getting to entertain all of you and play games. No! Bring him with your parrying move. Get out of here. Recover and lost power. 200 freaking souls! That's a lot of power. Or at least it used to be a lot of power. Now it's just like, whatever, man. Oi! I got plenty of power. Everything is going to be, uh... I, I don't know. Frankly, like... People usually don't... Tw between you and me, Turtles, like... A lot, of, a lot of folks say they'll show up and then don't. And I kind of make me sad. Because... I would love to be able to be, like... You know, if, if, if all the people that watch consistently showed up every day, I'd be affiliate ranked by now, but it yeah, is what it is. How do I attack this kill? He keeps on trying to get in front of me. Oh. Good news though, I killed his tail. I think I need to fix my armor. Let me, uh, let me kill these guys and then go back to the blacksmith dude and be like, Hey, can you fix my armor real quick? fight the other guys the the horde up here and we'll get like 900 souls and then that'll be perfect to fix my armor hey the blacksmith pay him off 
you will fix my armor because I'm gonna freaking pay you money. Oh, no problem. We're not we're not too far into things. No, we're only at what 142. Only. Only 142. Oh, come on! At least I'll get more souls to fix shit at the blacksmith. Any fun Valentine's Day plans? Uh, no. I don't have any sort of love life. And frankly, like... I wish I had a girlfriend. I wish I had, I wish I had some sort of romantic relationship, but I'm just a, I'm just a loser. <laughs> No drinking! Okay, 1,092 souls. That should be more than enough for the blacksmith to fix my friggin' armor. Appreciate it. Oh, well, like, what, what would I do on Valentine's Day? Like... I know what I would want to do. I guess look for a job because that's what family is making me do. I get where they're coming from. I just like. I'm just, I'm just a sad kind of person. Maybe I can try and find some people that are willing to watch me. Well, I don't know the more the merrier, right? Anything for. Prepare equipment. I need a lot of souls to repair this stuff, it would appear. It appears I need more souls than I thought to repair this stuff. Goodness! I need to go soul hunting! Well, tomorrow my plan is that I'm gonna be playing more, uh... 3D World plus Bowser's Fury. Cause that was fun. I'm gonna try and get all the, the shinies that you can get in the Fury mode. I think that's gonna be our new Sunday game, because we finished Odyssey. And then, you know, we'll stick to Dark Souls. I, I think I'm actually gonna sit down and make a freaking schedule for once. Like, I have a mental schedule, but, like, I want an actual, like, PDF. If that makes any sense. And I know you guys. You guys are awesome. I don't deserve you guys. You're too cool. Hello! How about no? How about you go over there and uh, don't? And just freaking don't. Okay, 
I'm more used to fighting these guys in the hallway, so I'm just gonna stick to the halls. Lance forward. I need to fix my armor. Oh, you do. Actually, <laughs> that's that's that's. I think this is the first time you've like legitimately beaten me to the new console generations. Like both of them. That's cool. I still need to get a PS5 and an Xbox Series X. That'll be the next things I get. Mentioning me coming over though, we all need to to uh well, friggin. Uh, you seem to need anything. Uh, what was I about to say? Damn, I forgot what I was gonna. Like, forgot what I was gonna. Oh yeah. Um, we all need to get together on Switch or something for a stream and play Ultimate Chicken Horse together. Cause I had so much fun playing that and I wanna and I wanna face you guys in that again. And that would make for some great content. We could all just get on a Discord call together and just try to screw each other over and It'd be great. And I forgot to reset the enemies, didn't I? Good job, Falcon! You forgot to reset the friggin' enemies! Oh no, not the PS5! No, it's it's fine. I have a PlayStation... I, I have a PlayStation 2? And I have a PlayStation 4, so I'll just go get a Yu-Gi-Oh! Fusion card and make a, a PlayStation 6. And it'll be awesome. Actually, let me check that new weapon that we found. The Gargoyle Tail Axe. Whoa! Why am I suddenly inflicted with, with bits of bleed and all that other shit? Oh, this looks like a powerful move. How strong is it, though? How strong is it? This is 93, and that's 120, so I don't need it yet. Not till I reinforce that shit. Some tight night shards. But still, having an axe seems like a good idea. Impressive dodging! be expected to say hi every single time. Sometimes I'm busy, sometimes I'm distracted, sometimes sometimes there's a friggin' enemy right in my face and I get this and I'm and I'm too busy on Well, 
no promises, but I do try. Alright, that should be enough to heal the helmet, too. So let's go back and... Heckin... 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 Fix helmet, please. While I'm still wearing it. Just... Just, you know, I, I, I'm undead. If I die, I just come back at the bonfire. So I'll just stick my head in the furnace and bang the helmet fix. Well, hello again. You hello again. You seem to be doing all right. You need anything forged? Repair equipment. Please fix my helmet. Oh, come on! I'll be seeing you then. Be careful out there. I need 880 and I have 806. Okay, you know what? Don't I have like a bunch of small souls of a lost undead or something? No, that's not. Not worth it. Uh, what did you miss? Pretty much nothing. much nothing. We got... I killed one of the gargoyles. And then the other killed me with his fire breath. I've died a few times. is currently, uh, uh, 143. Compared to 139, no, 138 last time. So I've died... Five times. Calculate. Well, I don't know what you seem to need any. Need anything forged, she says. Bonk, he just bonks his. Hel he just bonks his hammer on my helmet. He's like, okay, you're good now. gonna bother with the bonfire because I still have I, I still have full health, full Estus flasks, and those enemies are dead. I know, but it's such a funnier image to think like, let me forge your helmet. <laughs> it's like Looney Tunes it. not really any need to worry about like safety or anything because again we're undead in this game if 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 through some way or another the blacksmith does that and i get killed by the impact i just wake up at the freaking bonfire that's like not like three or four feet away it's not a problem Like, if I if I were a doctor in in Dark Souls, the quickest solution to like a broken limb or whatever is just freaking stab him and dead. 
And then they come back at the bonfire, and it's like, okay, cool, you're good. Pay me five hundred dollars. Okay, so since I already chopped off his tail, does he have the tail again? He does! He does. He does. Seriously, that was my fault. Not this time. This time it's not even pretty close. But the other time I almost had him. Like, I literally had the second gargoyle down to, like... Like, 5% of his health, and then he just decided to, that he had a... I had garlic breath and freaking breathed fire on my face. No, I already got the count. I already, I already added. Oh, come on! Is everything at risk? Now I actually need a. Uh, Are you still moving? I had it paused! Bullshit! Using the gargoyle tail axe until I can fix my side sword. Ugh. I think that's just what it applies when I equip it. Oh. This thing sucked! 57 damage! My other sword. You have my long sword. I can at least do something with that. All right, fine. So now I gotta go over to blacksmith and fix this weapon too. Me. 
I need to just buy repair powder. So that I can fix this shit on the fly. No time to look at memes now, dude! And I am cheered up. I am I'm am, I'm am very happy with this situation right now. Seriously though, I can't I, I literally cannot stop a stream to go open up my mail and check a meme, not when I have an active audience. Okay, that should be enough to fix the side sword. That should be enough, that should be enough, that should be enough. Please, 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 please be enough to fix my side sword. I want to have my side sword back. My awesome friggin' Ultra Blade. Which I might just spend the next couple hours reinforcing off, off stream. So it's like plus 17 or something. How many Titanite shards can I throw on that thing? It better be a big number. Yo. Well, hello. You it need any. Oh, I only need 168 souls. <laughs> I'll just fix all my stuff. Dang it, you're not selling repair powder, huh? Alright, fine. More importantly though, weapons back. Ta da! I have my Baldur's side sword plus five. Everyone needs to kneel now. In terror. At my epic awesomeness. Because I am once again powered up. You don't know? I don't know either. I haven't encountered a way to sell stuff, because I have like 15 short swords, and I really don't need 15 short swords. Like, what do you need 15 short swords for? Sir, if I knew, I would tell you. of like rolling up in borderlands with like 1500 guns in your backpack and it's like i use two of these the rest are just there it's like okay why don't you sell them because i might need them when was the last time you needed them never have you beaten the entire game yep so you don't need them nope then why do you keep them just in case Oh, 
Oh good, they're both out now, huh? Excuse you! I'm trying to drink my water here! Excuse you! I'm trying to freaking drink my water here! God damn it! Hey, you know it'll be nice! You know, it'd be nice if these guys got like 1% easier every time. That'd be awesome. I'll just trial and error. Once I learn their pattern, I just have to get lucky. Down, fight me out here. You jerk. Wall saved me from his parry move. Did anyone else catch that? Because I like swung and hit the friggin' wall, I didn't die to the parry move. Where he just like absolutely annihilates you in one hit. Who am I locked onto? Why am I locked onto that guy? You guys could probably do a lot better than me. I suck at this. You came here to watch me fail. You came here to watch me suffer. And you know what? I accept that. Because sometimes people are just sadistic. Sometimes people can only gain appreciation and a good laugh through someone else's eternal suffering in Dark Souls. I'd like to see you guys do better. I really don't. I, I accept that you guys are way better than me at this. to me that board games, it never really occurred to me that board games need to be play tested. I guess they do. Hmm. 
Maybe. Maybe we can play around. Or two. Later. Not right now. Right now, I gotta go kill a gargoyle again. For like the third time. I know it makes sense, but it's one of those things that like no one thinks about. Like everyone fantasizes about being a video game playtester, but no one ever says like, hey, you know what would be cool? Like, I wonder who playtested the novel. No one ever thinks about that. No one ever is like, hey, who, who made... Like, we know who made it. Like, no one ever looks up like, hey, who playtested this? Who, what unfortunate troll had to play like 500 rounds of Monopoly to make sure that it worked correctly? Right? Well, I chopped his tail off and then the other guy showed up and killed me. Oh, well, I'll tell you this much. If it's based on Mystery Dungeon, Nate probably won't want to play it. He doesn't like Mystery Dungeon very much. Ye speak blasphemy around here, sir. for me, I say. I mean, I get it. You just had a bad experience with it. are always interesting. Like, I've, I've, I've played a few... Yeah, Super Mystery Dungeon sucked. Uh... Like, it kind of went downhill after the third game. Enjoyed the Explorers games. Everyone's got their own opinion, Nate. I personally didn't. Really, I, I personally felt like Super Mystery Dungeon was a bit of a slog. Like it was just sort of there. Chop your tail off! I know what to do this time! Oh, the other one's here too, so I gotta watch out for that. Where am I? Okay, so you're breathing fire. Very bad. And then I need to run. I need to run in blood. Come on! I rolled backwards three times, and each time he hit me. Oh, 
Okay, if we're talking about cool Game Boy Color games, granted, you know, I don't, I don't want, I don't want you hogging all the conversation because everyone else is here too, and they deserve a, a chance to talk. But if we're talking cool Game Boy Color games, does anyone else remember Kirby Tilt and Tumble? It had like a built-in gyroscope so that you could like tilt the control or tilt the whole system and it would move Kirby. Like that was the concept. It was awesome. Yeah, like how's everyone else's day going? I, I, I as much as as much as like I don't as much as I enjoy Nate's company, I want to make sure that all of you have a chance to talk. No one hogs any conversation around you. No. Hashtag fight me on the steps. He says. I don't think there was a Hot Wheels game for the for the Game Boy Color. I know that there was a Hot Wheels game for the Wii that had a pool table track. Hmm. By the way, uh, let's take a moment and celebrate because we are at 150 deaths! That was sarcastic clapping, by the way. They can't be the one that I was thinking of. I was thinking of, uh, bringing the Tonka game. Good? Never mind! Never mind! issue with this fight that I'm realizing as I go through this isn't that isn't that uh, the bosses are dealing a crap ton of damage it's that they're not giving me a chance to heal oh I know exactly what Scooby-Doo game you're talking about it took me forever to figure that game out too Yep. It had a lab and weird symbols that you needed to find. Did you seriously just call Daphne the purple dress girl? Good grief. Do you not know Scooby-Doo? Dark Souls GBA edition. Backlit Souls. 
<laughs> and then the title screen kills you. One of my favorite uh, Game Boy Color games is I had this like Tonka truck style game where you like, you, like fire rescue and shit. It was awesome. I loved it. years ago. I'm actually starting to get annoyed now. Yeah. It's not even the fight that's annoying, it's just the fact that I gotta go through all these enemies over and over and over and over and over and over. down to a science, but it still takes a minute and a half to get up here. And then there's these jumps where I gotta go like, okay, slicey, slicey. Oh. do retro games at some point, like just get an emulator and do like some old school games, but I feel like I would need a bigger audience to, to enjoy that. I don't know why. Probably because like I wouldn't attract any new people. And you know, you guys are awesome, but you know, the more the merrier. And I want to make everybody happy. I want to make, I want to, I want to make sure that everyone gets to watch and have a great time and a good laugh as I get my ass whooped by the Bell Gargoyle for the 15th time. Why aren't you landing? Land and attack me, damn you. One health. Hang on, let me heal. Shit, cancel, cancel, cancel! Run, damn you! You can't... You... Who gives... Who gives... A boss... An area of effect attack... And then also the ability to corner you. That's just bad gameplay. Like, I get it, this is supposed to be hard, but there's a difference between hard and legitimately unfair. And this is very, very crossing into the legitimately unfair territory. If, 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 
there was a bigger arena? Absolutely! If there was a... If there was... If there was, uh... Only one of them? Absolutely! I'd be perfectly fine with that. Sure, give him the AoE attack that can, can wipe me out. As long as you can't back me into a wall and force a death. played a power buff girls game. I mean don't get me wrong, like it, it, I don't think any of us here ever like even watched Power Puff Girls. I mean cash grab market games like that are are usually bad cliche. I think Nate just likes laughing at stuff. Me especially. Me fucking up. I'm like the court jester that, that just bumbles around and trips, and every time I trip, the whole courtroom a laugh, erupts in laughter. And no one stops to ask if the jester is ever needs a moment to recollect his thoughts. He's just supposed to be funny constantly, and no one ever asks how he's doing or if he's okay, because, you know, maybe, maybe, maybe he's having a bad day, but no, it's his job to be fun. What the fuck? What's that bullshit? He pretty like hooked me on his tail. Second one shows up. Yep, you're there. Hi, friend. I need to come over here and heal, so if you could just chill for a minute. No! the first gargoyle and, st and kill him before the second one showed up. This is unfair. This is legitimately unfair. If, if I were a playtester, I would send this back and say fix this. Because... Yeah, I get it. Dark Souls is a hard game, but I don't want a game that's so hard that I want to quit. No developer wants their game to be so hard that the player wants to quit.
Let the record show that we are one hour, six minutes, and thirty seconds into the stream, and I'm already fucking done. Like, I'm not so done that I'm gonna, like, cry or anything. It, it takes a lot to actually make me openly weep. But, like, I'm freaking done. I can't... I can't summon a buddy. You know why? You know why? Because I need the PlayStation Network, and that costs $25. Because even with the updates, I still need to be signed into the PlayStation Network, and my subscription is friggin' dead. Believe me, if I could have summoned a buddy, I would have done it by now. In desperation. I sure as hell ain't bringing him to this fight. I don't want him dying on me. Besides, I only have so many summoning stones. I need to save them. For never. shit again, ever. E even, even the fact that I won, like, I'm not even happy. I'm just pissed. What did I even freaking get? I got a gargoyle helmet. Fifteen, 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 five hundred. Sure, I'll put that on. I have a cool helmet now. What do you have to say to that? Do I get to ring the bell now? Like, I literally did this all to ring a bell. They better give me the rare drop after 15 friggin' times. these two didn't decide to show up. Okay, I rang the bell. Oh, 
Art thou pleased? Ring the bell, undead church, trophy got earned. So this is when the other gargoyle- Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> okay, hi! Hi! Greetings. I am Oswald of Carree, the pub. Thou fearest to thy face. Yet magnanimous are the gods. Cometh out to confess? Or to accuse? For indeed all sin. I'm sorry, what? Abandoned Covenant? Request absolution. You have not sinned. No covenants to abandon. Purchase item. Purging Stone! Uh, reduces curse buildup and breaks curse. Indictment. Indictment. Report Trespass of Invader. Homeward Bone. Book of the Guilty. Karmic Justice. Vilka's Talisman. Bloodbite Ring. <laughs> Lose nothing on death, but ring breaks. <sighs> That'll last five seconds. Thou art welcome any time. It is only human to commit a sin. <laughs> Don't make me go back there and stab you for friggin' startling me. I did it. I did it. I made progress. I rang a bell. And I think I have enough to go back and level up. As long as nothing else shows up to try and stab me. Let me, let me save, please. I can now sell stuff. I can? Let me level up first. Apparently I need more strength. Go to the Firelight Shrine. I know where the Firelink Shrine is. In that, uh, down in the starting area? Do I need to ring the other bell, though? Where's the other bell? I don't see another bell. I said there were two bells. It may have been a good month and a half since we started playing this, but I still remember there are two bells. Did it, 
ba -da -da. Ba -da -da -da. Okay, we're here. The Firelink Shrine. You, you try to come up with good elevator music on the fly. I think it's like perfect elevator music. Why, what a surprise. I didn't expect you to make it. Oh, somebody rang the bell. Wait, was it you? You never give up, do you? I don't know how you do it. Well, don't stop now. Only one... <laughs> Okay, so where do I sell this? Where do I sell my stuff? And where's the other bell? Anyone? What if I go this way? I never went this way. It's a big bird. Okay. Look, if they don't attack me anymore, for, from now on out, if they don't attack oh me... My. Oh, I have to await my... So what if I were to teach... Would that please you? Yes. Very well. Join Covenant. Covenant established. Now, let me share my... Only their ultimate effectiveness. Great heal excerpt. Homeward. Force. Seek guidance. Heal. Homer is a free warp the back to the effectiveness of the teachings depend upon your faith. Well, thank you. Uh, it looks like Homeward is a is a free warp to the last bonfire without dying. So I came from there. Let me. Well, uh. Fudge, what did I just do? What did I just do? Oh no! Am I stuck? Oh 
Oh, no, no, I'm not. Sorry, I didn't mean to break that. I wanted the rest of the bonfire covenant. What is this? Way of light. Oh, I already belong to that covenant. Okay, but where's the next bell? of them. Impressive leap, dude. I gotta give it to you. Know thy science. Where is the next bell? Is it over this way? Turtles, you've played Dark Souls, right? Please help. Back to where I am, where I was, but I don't know where the next bell is. Where's my next objective? We're at the fire link. I think this is the fire link shrine, right? Oh, wait, I have a level up. Stairs near fire. What? Was this here the whole goddamn time? Who painted this guy gold? Hello? Ah. Hello there. I have your reward. Please, accept it. Sunlight metal. I am grateful to you for freeing me. <laughs> Not enough for you. Well, let's not be greedy now. <laughs> I'll take a medal. I don't know what it does, but I'll take it. of the ultimate honor. A faint, this faintly warm medal engraved with the symbol of the sun is the ultimate honor, awarded to those who summon the warrior of sunlight to complete it and complete a goal. She cannot speak. Wait, what? Reinforce Estes Flask. 
Use Fire Keeper Soul to reinforce Estes Flask. Yes. Flask reinforced. Estes Flask plus one. I knew hanging onto that thing was a good idea. You now they probably heal more or something. I would have preferred just getting an extra five on the Estus Flask, but... Eh. Jump. Where are we going? Who dares threaten the man in the fancy helmet and the hammer pants? Nah, it's fine. Don't, don't, don't wiki anything. I, I, I can figure it out. Hey. Hey, how you doing? New Londo Ruins. Oh, you poor creatures. I never played Twilight Princess. So I wouldn't know. There's no bridge here, huh? Oh, there is. Hang on. I'm guessing water bad. That's fine. There's no, there, there, there's no reason they throw a boss in right after I beat the last one. Step here. Hey, what the fudge? I can't hurt them. I can't hit them. Why can't I hit them? I gotta get the fudge out of sun badge for anything. Yeah, I can't use it. It's not an item that I can use. Alright, well, uh, why don't we just try running past them? Bye. How you doing? You having a good day? I'm having a good day. I'm having a good day too. You having a good day? We're fine. You can't catch me. Clap, 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 clap. You can't catch me. Just flat up deny them. I had leftover pizza for dinner. It was good. How many of these friggin' scythe ghosts are there? Oh shit, oh shit, fudge. Oh, they're not scythe ghosts, they have two daggers. No, I will find out on my own. It, it might just mean that I need to go a different direction. A lot of a lot of streamers, myself included, tend to like dislike when folks just straight up give us the 
exact thing to do. Like, if I wanted a walkthrough, I would look up a walkthrough. I don't like being force-fed a walkthrough. Slight difference, you know? Gotta be willing to- oh, shit. No one told me the elevator didn't go back up when it f f <laughs> This guy's just like, oh look, look at this chump loser idiot. He fell down the steps. does sound painful. I was gonna say, like, I forget the exact physics, but, uh, oh, how nice of them to bring the thing back up for me. I forget the exact physics, but, like, three stories or more of a drop should be lethal in some cases. And, like, we fell... A long way. New Londo Ruins! Again. What's up this way? It's locked. Okay, fine. Be that way. Oh, pfft. look at this guy doing the painting like one of your French girls pose. Wait, what? What? No! You can't just end the stairs in the dark! Oh, hey, you're back again. <laughs> okay, there's one other thing I can try here. Because I, I vaguely remember, and this is like... This has been itching at the back of my brain for a while, to be completely honest. There was like a, a way over here or something, a graveyard. Yeah. That you told me, don't go this way because it's like too hard right now. But this is at the start of the game. right now, frankly. Okay, how much does this Estus blast kill? Whoa! That's a lot of Estus.
kick you off the ledge. There you go. Reform from that. Sucker. Oh, that's a lot of them. Oh, that's a big boy! Oh, I forgot to heal. Okay, but at the very least, I know where I'm going now, so it's like... Oops, wrong direction. Oh. Our... Our... Piercing weapons better against these guys, or like, because these guys look like they'd be weak to bludgeoning. Oh. Like maybe just square up with a morning star or something. I don't know. Usually the enemy collapses. If they're if they're if they're not flesh and blood, stabbing usually isn't a good idea. I mean it's doing an okay job. <laughs> I don't know, let's equip I'm pretty sure I have like a, a smashing weapon Yeah, the morning star I'll hear a joke I'm just, you know I, I, I'm usually busy so that I can't respond to everything you say, dude. Again, can't. So some people actually find it like an, uh, a, a bit difficult to. Okay, that didn't do much. I guess these guys are just resilient. Oh. What is an astronaut's favorite food? Hmm. I swear I've heard this one. You they get counters? Jeez. I don't know. What's an astronaut's favorite food? That's cheesy. That sounds like something that I'd find on the back of like a Laffy Taffy wrapper. Maybe in a bit. Let me let me focus on these guys first. I got, I got issues. Well, these guys are my issues, but like... Oh shit. He has a combo attack. Okay, go ahead. I hope everyone else is still enjoying themselves, because I'm <laughs> I've seen nothing but Nate and Cat, and that's making me nervous. Is 
that I'm driving some of you away or something, or someone is driving. Oh, obviously the praying mantis. Which is ironic because praying mantises are actually like carnivores. Like, like they they are very aggressive. Ah. So they are not men of God. Oh. Oh, come on with the counter-attack! Blood loss! Yeah, no kidding! but like I'm more concerned with like I'm concerned with the fact that you're the only one that's been talking for the past like 20 minutes like I don't know if it's me or, or something that I said I'm just worried that I'm, that I'm making people uncomfortable somehow maybe it's not me oh. Oh. ah Fair enough. I just I just wasn't sure. Sideways, backwards, whatever. It doesn't matter. At the end of the day... Did. The mood, the mood, I don't feel like the mood was dark at all in the first place. Like, it didn't need to be lightened. I'm just having fun. Oh. Like, as much as I complain, as, as much as I say, like, oh, screw this and, and whatnot, if I genuinely wasn't enjoying myself, I would have stopped a long time ago. Aggro those guys. Really? I thought you did like seeing me miserable. I certainly laugh every time I kick the bucket in this game. That's what I thought, you chumps! <laughs> Alright, where are we going now then? What's down this tunnel? Tunnel of Doom. The Catacombs! What the fudge? Red? Redness? Why are their faces and why are they screaming at me?
Okay, yeah, I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. I need a break. I need a break. I need a break. I need a break. I need to stop before I get pissed off. So we are going to go find someone to raid. Sorry. I'm, I just, I, I just, I'm, mm. 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 It's a bitter, it's a bitter pill. A bitter taste. Here, go watch someone else playing Dark Souls. This person's playing Dark Souls. All right, well, thank you all then so much for watching, and until next time, this is Fearless Falcon, signing off. See you later.